Hello and welcome to another Bad Lego review. Um, today I'm going to be looking at the last four of the Series 9 male figures and then in my next uh, episode I've got the last four female figures. So to kick off we have uh, Mr. Good and Evil aka Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. Um, great figure with the crazy scientist vial of, of fluid there. Great detail on his clothes and even the the hat is half good and half evil appears to be um, but hopefully you can get a nice view of his face there which is a nice little reptilian grin um, my way of spotting this guy or finding him when I was filling the packs in the shop was to feel for the the triangular vial when I felt that I had to make sure it wasn't the bottle from the waiter set and then I looked out for the hat of this character as well. You can spot a top hat and just feel for the ridges. And again, just make sure it's not the police hat because that has a little ridge and feels pretty similar through the plastic as well. Next figure was the one I was most uh, excited or, or looking forward to getting. This took me a while. Is the chicken suit guy because of these great custom arms which you won't see on on other figures or not yet at least there's no actually hand in there it's just been placed on if I just show you the inside I'm not sure you'll be able to see this but it's just been clipped on as like a normal arm uh, but this guy has got the helmet or, or, or mask of the chicken and that's what I first spotted and as soon as I felt like it was a mask of some kind I could feel the ridges along the top of his hat and there he is. Great figure with the wings as well. Next up is our plumber. Quite a generic sort of city figure really if you ask me but one thing I do really like about this um, this character if he comes into focus um, is this plunger. This is all one piece and it's rubberized and that's how I spotted him I felt for that that stick and then I felt this on the end it's all attached in one go and I don't know if it actually works as a, a plunger not really so he's a good figure and then finally I have the battle mech which is um, one that a lot of people like I think it's gonna look a lot like the Galaxy Quest figures coming out soon and this guy is made of a helmet and he's got a single sided face with what looks like a visor there and he also has some armour too this is how to spot this guy if you can got the two pegs on the back so if you can feel for those that's your battle mat. Um There'll be another video coming soon of the four females, as I said, last to come in the series. Check out and subscribe if you can. Leave a comment. Love to hear from you.